What's up guys? We partnered with Prime Fresh to celebrate game day. We've seen a lot of snack stadiums online, but none of them were made out of just sandwiches. I know what you're thinking, it seems basic. But if you look at our thumbnail, it's, it's pretty beautiful. We haven't actually made it yet. But before we get started, we wanna give you guys a chance to win $5,000. To register, go to primefreshdeli.com slash sweeps. Vote for your favorite recipe, enter in your info, and make sure you check the box to join the mailing list. You'll be able to read up on new recipes, receive coupons, and get details on more sweepstakes. Just make sure to enter at primefreshdeli.com slash sweeps before November 4th. Guys, it's $5,000, and we hope one of you win. All right, JP, let's get to work. We are going to be talking about the sandwich stadium right now. So I'm thinking, let's just make the whole thing out of sandwiches. Let's not complicate things. Easy enough, like sure. And then you're gonna have a sandwich here. We could do shredded lettuce on the field. And then we're like, wait, I don't know how much meat I need. I don't know how much bread. We gotta draw this thing out. We wanna get the measurements right though. I wanted it to be the same dimensions as a real football field. Football field's 360 feet by 160 feet. You take that ratio and then you scale it down. I'm kind of terrible at math. I'm okay at math if I have a calculator. Well, maybe what we should do is have like lettuce, tomato. This is a mustard pit, mustard pit, mayo pit, mayo pit. Is that everything? We figured it out. We're only gonna need seven ingredients to build the entire stadium. We're throwing a party and everybody is going to feast on this giant sandwich snack stadium. Let's go! Go to the store! Boo boo! Bring me the meat. Marvel at that beautiful transparent package. Did you know it's gluten free? No MSG. And we're gonna be using all the meat. Rotisserie seasoned chicken breast. Honey ham. Oven roasted turkey breast. Smoked turkey breast. Smoked ham. Roast beef. That is a lot of meat. If there's any of this that's gonna be left over, the Ziploc keeps it fresh super long. They all come in half pound bags, eight slices per bag. If we're gonna do three slices per sandwich, we're doing 100 sandwiches. We're gonna need 300 slices. How many packages is that? I need a calculator. It's like, four, it's like 40. Are you my calculator? Yes, I'm, of course tell me your calculator. This stadium's gonna look. It's already so beautiful. You're, you're terrifying me. I'm terrifying you? Yeah. Because I don't know what I'm doing? Yeah. I started building, I had no idea what I was doing. I just wanted to make it look pretty, and I'm thinking, oh, I'll just like stagger loaves of bread and add some cheese. JP starts to build, and I'm not really understanding his concept 100%. I'm out of here. And I ended up looking really good. Like, I thought it looked really good. But then after two hours of doing this, and all I got done was one section of the stadium, I'm like, maybe, maybe this isn't the best idea. We've got another idea. JP, this is a lot. This is a lot of sandwiches. Looks good, I'm doing a good job. So, JP and I figured it out. He's gonna leave me at home to make all the sandwiches. Are you watching Law and Order? Yeah, because I was bored. <laughs> I can help you. Ashley, you know how you can help me? You can help me by never ever doing this again. Do you understand that? Here's the roast beef, and you got the chicken. Not because you are a chicken, but a okay. game. All right, now that there's more space in the fridge, because they're gonna use another fridge that's out there, Law and Order's still on, and I still have more sandwiches to make. Can I stay with you? No, honey, mommy's working. Like all of you stay with me? No, she can't. We only got turkey left. More sandwiches. How long did it take you? Four hours? I made like 127 plus sandwiches. We only have an hour and a half before the party starts, so hopefully this doesn't take too long. You look great. Thank you. All right, the sandwiches are done. We're about ready to go set up the party. You coming with me, JP? Julia's got all the sandwiches made, the party's gonna start soon, and we gotta build this thing. So JP starts to construct the stadium. I don't know what I'm doing. Julia's recording me. If you like white bread and you like meat, this is for you. So then I had to get my little knife and I had to cut in all the sandwiches. It didn't look that pretty, but I was like, you know what, moving along, we just gotta keep going with it. This is like any kid's dream. You don't gotta worry about the vegetables. So what we're gonna do here is we're only gonna do one row, kind of like curve. We get around the corner, and then we do a little stagger action. This thing is gonna be freaking huge. 
This is definitely the right size table. More the ones that we broke up are still being used. all my friends come to the party because this is all a lot of sandwiches. I mean, I feel like what we demonstrated is that anyone can make this sandwich stadium. I only have one more loaf of bread, which is only gonna end up being six more sandwiches. So move these roast beef over here and then just have the ham on this side. Yeah, see, that looks better, I think. I like that. It was super fun. For the goalposts, we just found these plastic things somewhere, don't eat it, and we just threw it into a block of cheese. I think we're gonna be just about the exact amount of sandwiches. I'm so proud of this. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. That's absolutely beautiful. I mean, the detail. And I was even able to bring back the bleachers just from a sketch on a piece of paper to reality. We're making this sandwich stadium so you can make your own sandwich. Grab whatever meat you like, grab whatever toppings. I think it was a success. Thank you guys so much for coming along on our build of a sandwich stadium. Don't forget to visit the link in the description for your chance to win $5,000. Just do it, I want you guys to win. And if you guys are planning on making a sandwich stadium or just a tasty sandwich, pick Prime Fresh Delicatessen, we highly recommend it. And I don't think it's too, too out of reach for y'all to be able to do this yourselves at home. We had a lot of fun making the stadium and we'll see you next time on another episode of Healthy Junk Poop. <laughs> All right, what's, what are we gonna do next? Castle out of <gasps> sliders. Oh, don't give it away. I'll just have like bleeps going up so they have no idea what I'm saying. <laughs>